I would like to use Star Trek to help you visualize the quantum nature of matter. So this is the Starship Enterprise D from Star Trek The Next Generation. And space is a dangerous place. So the Enterprise has an energy shield that can protect it. And here you can see the shield um, around the ship even though normally in reality it is visible. It's invisible until something comes into contact with it and hits the shield, at which point the energy in the shield co coalesces at that point toward the danger. So as you can see here, the, the beam coming from the upper right hitting the shield. Now this is how I visualize the nature of electrons in their energy shields around an atom's nucleus. So the electrons op move around in these energy shields, and it is energy that is smeared out in a probability shell like a shell like the shield of the Enterprise until it is measured at, at which point we can know its location. Knowing its location we cannot know where it is going to next except somewhere in the probability shell. This is the Heisenberg uncertainty principle. So we can we know that the electrons are in the shell and we can measure it at this point but if we measure it at this point, we don't know where it's going to be next in the shell because because the energy is basically smeared out in the shell like the energy is spread out around the Enterprise. The transporters in Star Trek Universe have Heisenberg compensators so they can work despite the uncertainty principle making it impossible to know the location and direction of subatomic particles. In the show, the transporters can dematerialize someone into energy and then put them back together again using knowing about the Heisenberg uncertainty principle meaning we can't know either the direction or the location of the subatomic particle particles then if you dematerialize somebody you couldn't put them back together again because you wouldn't know where all the pieces were um, so that's in the in the fictional world of Star Trek that's how they deal with that uncertainty principle is they have invented compensators for that. And sometimes this happens. No shields can protect against a giant space hand. And quantum mechanics cannot explain giant space hands. But they haven't been seen since the 1960s and modern CGI effects were invented. <laughs>